That's why I decided to come to explore Lahore Museum today. At first glance, it fascinates me with its red brick building blends the old tradition of Mughal architecture. Lahore Mall Road Park situated ye building design kiti Sir Ganga Ramne discuss structure complete Huata 1819 me. This building is home to the country's largest and oldest collection of historical, cultural, religious and artistic objects. Wow, it is so beautiful. It is really, really beautiful. Look at the ceiling. It's my first time seeing such a ceiling before. It's really beautiful. There is a map here. Let's check because I think it is the map of the building, of the museum. So we can see yaha kya kya hai. <laughs> Guys, look, yaha bohot gallery hai, Gandhara gallery hai, yaha Islamic gallery hai or Sikh gallery as well and as you can see we have like Hindu Buddhist Jain gallery as well there are like I think there are like more than 17 galleries here and it's going to be a treat for you because today we are going to learn so many things here and I'm very excited about it look at the map and look at the history here and look at the history which we can find it here in this museum it is so beautiful so let's go to explore The facade of the building is very detailed and interesting. हम म्यूजियम का तौर शुरू करता है तो सबसे पहले आपका लेफ्ट और राइट पार ओल्ड कार्व डोर्स डिस्प्लेड है दे आर वेरी ओल्ड बट सो वेल प्रिजर्वड When you enter here, when you enter the museum, 19th century doors nazar aata hai yaha. As you can see, there are some beautiful windows and beautiful doors, and these are called akbari doors from the Mughal era. And these are very detailed, as you can see, and very beautiful. And as you can see, these are carved wooden doors and windows, which are very beautiful.
As per the museum food direction, we will continue our tour from the prehistoric and Indus Valley Gallery. Right now I'm in the prehistoric part of the museum and this part belongs to the Stone Age and prehistoric period. See how beautiful they are so, and as you can see there are some other detailed things here as well and we have some other stones and these are used for chopping you know they were using these kind of stones to chop something and these are from Son Valley, which was located in the, you know, Raval Pindi region. And there are some arrowheads as well. These are so beautiful. And it is written two million years ago. Like, can you imagine two million years ago? Right now, I'm in front of Mehergar section, which was the oldest city of the world and oldest civilization, we can say. And these things were found between 7000 and 2600 BC, which means these things here are very, very old. How unbelievable it is, you know. Right now, I'm in front of the history and I'm so excited and so fascinated. It's great to find objects and artifacts being collected from such an old era. Explains well the rich culture of the present day of Pakistan. Is kitte ki hazaron sal purani chiza dekar herangi hoti hai ki yahan ke log itna sal pehle bhi itne civilized the. So in that time they were using these stones to measure the things. I think it's beautiful. <laughs> stems from that era. Balls and even jewelries are displayed here. This valley civilization ki bohot bari utensils collection mevjud hai. So fascinating. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Thank you so much for sparing some time for us and thank you so much for welcoming us. Can you please tell us uh, about this museum a little bit? Yeah, thank you very much to your channel for visiting the Lahore Museum <laughs> and showing the world what heritage is. Just here. You see this where you are standing, this is our prehistoric and Indus gallery, Indus civilization gallery. Mm -hmm. From here uh, we have artifact from Paleolithic mm -hmm. period in Pakistan, Puthar near Rawalpindi. Very good. You will be happy to know that. Wow. In Puthar region, Valley, Sama Valley. Mm -hmm. Our forefathers were living in Stone Ages, mm -hmm. in the period. In the other showcase, next showcase, we mm -hmm. have artifact from Mehrgarh. Mm -hmm. Mehrgarh, you see, Mehrgarh is in Koyta, mm -hmm. near Koyta, in the Luchistan province of Pakistan. Mm -hmm. And it dates back amazingly wow. up to 7000 BC. Mm -hmm. At that time, women were wearing beautiful head dresses, mm -hmm. beautiful dresses, mm -hmm. gents also, their drinking, mm -hmm. uh, pottery were engraved with beautiful flowers. That's beautiful. That is amazing. amazing. What? Mm -hmm. uh, I will I, I, I will again thank you. Oh, thank for you your so channel. much. Thank you. And to tell the people to come here. Mm -hmm. Yes. And see what is here. Mm -hmm. And then starts the Bronze Age period. Mm -hmm. 
from Indus Valley civilization. <laughs> we come to here, we see the artifact, <laughs> bulk art of that time, wow. the ways and scales of that time, how precise they were. <laughs> it means they were very formal in their business, <laughs> in their commercial activities, and also very civilized to deal with each other. <laughs> and then famous stops of <laughs> the Indus Valley, famous all over the world, mm, yeah. with the unicorn and other animals on them. Wow! And these are the stumps of the world. What is it written on it? This is very important to know. The world is working on my research. When it goes, it will be written on them. Mm -hmm. It has been written on them. It will be a great revolution mm -hmm. in the area of civilization. Of yeah. This valley, people will love it. Interestingly, Dice, was the yeah. of them. Dice, original dice is here. <laughs> and it means they people know the uh, use of Riyazi, <laughs> mathematics. They know the use of Riyazi, mathematics. They know the use of the game. They know the game. They know the game. They know the game. They know the game. Chess is the game. They know the board. They know the game. 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 They know the me and my team unko ye cheeze batate hain they are astonishingly stunned wow. and pleased yeah aur dekhne jewelry dekhne original hai ye original hai sab ya of wow. indus valley original mm -hmm. okay original in mm -hmm. this gallery mm -hmm. there is nothing non original oh, everything is right. original <laughs> everything is mm -hmm. original right. and we are proud of this civilization this is, we, we are proud mm -hmm. as Pakistani, as Lahori, but we, we, we owe it to the world heritage. We say that this is the world's heritage. The world's heritage. The world's heritage. Yes. And see how many civilized Pakistanis are. And how much they were shocked. And how their soft image was. Yes. They are very good people. They are very good people. In Lahore Museum, सारे लीजेंस के आर्टिफैक्ट लेके रखे हुए सिख कह लें बुद्धा कह लें हिंदू कह लें जैन कह लें जिसका भी नाम ले लें इस्लाम कह लें सारी चीजें हैं फिर क्या है ये इंटरफेथ हार्मनी को प्रमोट कर रहा है ये पीस को प्रमोट कर रहा है और वी आर वेरी हैप्पी ऑन डूइंग दिस वर्क थैंक यू सो मच बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया बहुत शुक्रिया थैंक यू सो मच Guys, मेरे सामने एक सिक्रिप्ट है गुरु ग्रंथ साहिब जी की ये बहुत होली है सिख कम्युनिटी के लिए और सिख कम्युनिटी ये किताब पढ़ता है स्पिरिचुअल गाइड के लिए एंड टीचिंग्स आर कॉल्ड गुरबानी because the things which are displayed here had never been displayed anywhere else sirf pakistani log ke liye nahi but duniya ke liye yahan har cheez bahut important hai but for especially sick people this place is a heaven the timeline of sick gurus is displayed here in a very self explanatory way यहाँ पर आपको 17th century की एरा से collected काफी interesting artifacts displayed मिलते हैं, the times when six were ruling the subcontinent. Guys, मेरे सामने एक script है गुरु ग्रंथ साहिब जी की, ये बहुत होली होली है सिख कम्युनिटी के लिए और सिख कम्युनिटी ये किताब पढ़ता है स्पिरिचुअल गाइड के लिए एंड टीचिंग्स आर कॉल्ड गुरबानी You also 
find the chair of the famous Mora Sarkar, jo Ranjit Singh ke zevje hone ke bawajood sari zindagi muslim rahe. Ye 17th century ke maaruf rakasa bhi thi. Wow! also find doors and windows from the 17th century from Punjab region of the subcontinent. No doubt the Sikh gallery is a must visit especially if you're into the history of Punjab. Guys, so in Lahore Museum, you can also find miniature paintings, as you can see here. And these miniature paintings were collected from different kind of creators of the museum after the Punjab exhibition in 1864. So let's go and explore them a little bit because they look so beautiful. So here, as you can see, there are so many pictures, there are so many paintings here and basically they are watercolor on paper and each picture, each tasvir tells us a different story from the Mughal Empire. For example, as you can see, we have a Yaha Ek picture here, who is very detailed. Hai. Just check the colors and you know the story on that. So we have some others and also here we can see the students' names and the dates and the school's names as well and the size of the uh, pictures too for example here we see uh, a beautiful woman I'm sure it tells a different kind of story as well so yeah let's check all together contemporary paintings gallery of this museum. Let's check out what kind of portraits do they have. Let's go. Bohot Bari collection Nazarati hai contemporary paintings ki. All of them are painted by the artists who belong in this region. Yaha jo artwork Nazarata hai, wo idar ki culture ko bohot acha se represent karta hai. This store has been so knowledgeable for me so far. Just wow! Secrets. The many secrets at Lahore Museum endeavors to cover the development of Islamic calligraphy from its inception to the present day. Calligraphy ka art is the most Written by Hazrat Imam Hassan radiallahu an. Idar apko Hazrat Imam Hussein radiallahu an ka likha hua Quran e Pak bi dekna ko milta hai. Next is the Jain Temple Gallery. This clearly shows that Pakistan is house of many religions.
is the gallery that represents all the present-day cultures of Pakistan, Northern areas, Punjab, Cholistan, Baluchistan, Kalash, Khyber Pakhtunkhwa, and Sindh. Pakistan has so many cultures and they are all rich and so vibrant. Every culture you find here has so much detail to it. Now I will be exploring the Islamic gallery. So guys, right now I'm in the Islamic section of the museum and there are so many interesting things here as well. Uh, for example, we have jugs and we have cups here and it is written iron tea set from 18th century, from 18th and 19th century and it is so beautiful and there are some, I think, other things here. Um, so it, it's written that enameled work, which is like, I think these are handmade, all of them. And they are very detailed and very beautiful. And there are some vases and breast containers here and these are very colorful and very detailed so it shows us that in islamic history people have always been into arts and crafts they are so beautiful so guys as you can see we have some belts here and we have necklaces earrings and other kind of exercises and these are so beautiful and as you can see these are very old and these are from mughal era but it's written here that uh, mughals didn't you know didn't find out any kind of patterns but they were improving the old ones so they all look so beautiful There is a silver pandan here, but when I came here for the first time, I didn't know what it was. Then I asked and I learned that people in the past were using uh, these boxes to keep their pumps. I have never tried it, but I'm looking forward to try it. Let's see. Turkey here too, yay! Off to the Gandhara Gallery. Gandhara art is the style of Buddhist visual art that developed in what is now northwestern Pakistan and eastern Afghanistan between the 1st century BCE and 7th century BCE. Historical findings bohot rare hai, and they were made in a such a detailed way. It amazes me. This kid is holding a bat. Maybe they used to play cricket in those times. Who knows? Guys, right now I'm in front of a casting Siddhartha. Siddhartha is very famous and people from all over the world come here to pray and to see Siddhartha. But I want you to come closer a little bit to see his body actually, because as you can see on his body, bones are visible, veins are visible, every detail are very visible.
के कई स्टैचूज बने मिलते हैं फ्रॉम वेरियस ओरिजिन लाइक श्रीलंका ईस्टर्न अफगानिस्तान एंड अदर पार्ट ऑफ प्रेजेंट डे पाकिस्तान बहुत बड़ी फोटो गैलरी है विद द पिक्चर्स ऑफ क्वाइर आजम फातिमा जिन्ना गांधी अलामा इकबाल एंड मेनी अदर्स हु डिवोटेड देयर लाइफ्स फॉर द फाउंडेशन ऑफ दिस ब्यूटीफुल कंट्री यहां आपको बुदा के कई स्टैचूज बने मिलते हैं फ्रॉम वेरियस ओरिजिन लाइक श्रीलंका Eastern Afghanistan and other parts of present day Pakistan Ek bahut badi photo gallery hai with the pictures of Quaid Azam, Fatima Jinnah, Gandhi, Allama Iqbal and many others who devoted their lives for the foundation of this beautiful country जबरदस्त कोइन गैलरी भी मौजूद है जहां आपको ह्यूज रेंज ऑफ कोइंस मिलती है हिंदुइज्म को भी यहां एक गैलरी बड़ी डिटेल में कवर करती है विद सो मेनी इंटरेस्टिंग एंड ऑल हिंदू आर्टिफैक्ट्स एंड स्कल्पचर्स बहुत बहुत अच्छा था लाहौर म्यूजियम इतना बड़ा है एंड आई गट टू लर्न सो मेनी थिंग्स टू दैट यू कैन फाइंड सो मेनी थिंग्स हियर नॉट ओनली पाकिस्तान हिस्टोरी बट ऑल्सो यू कैन फाइंड प्रे हिस्टोरी अबाउट द सब कॉन्टिनेंट सो इट वॉज अ बिग जॉब फॉर मी टू कम हियर एंड टू एक्सप्लोर एवरी थिंग हियर सो राइट नाउ आई एम काइंड टायर्ड एंड हंगरी सो लेट्स सी वट आई कैन फाइंड हियर टू इट रोड लुक्स इवन मोर ब्यूटिफुल इन द नाइट आई थिंक ये अच्छी जगह लग रही है खाना के लिए आई सी कफे सामल रिच नो देर Right now I have reached the mall food court. It is only 1 km away from the Lahore Museum and it is opposite GPO station. As you can see there are so many cuisines here, so many restaurants and cafes, but there is only one cafe which took my attention and it is Cafe Istanbul because I am from Istanbul. So I am very excited to try some food here. So let's go and explore what they have. Let's go. यहाँ पे तुर्किश खाना मिलेगा और नहीं जी मैम बिल्कुल मिलेगा आप तुर्किश से हाँ मैं तुर्की से वेलकम टू पाकिस्तान थैंक यू सो मच वेर शुड आई सेट प्लीज मैम ओके I have been there before. Very nice. <laughs> आप लाहौर फोर्ट गई नॉट येट बट इट्स ऑन माई लिस्ट बाई दे ये कौन है मैम ये मैडम नूर जहान है पाकिस्तान की लेजेंड सिंगर हैं मेरे नाम नूर बानो है नूर बानो नूर जहान यू नो वेरी नाइस इट साउंड सिमिलर एक्चुअली और बट आई नो दिस सिंगर नुसरत फतेह अली खान राइट यस मैम या बिकॉज आई लिसन टू कवाली सो आई नो हेम ओके सो आई सेट ओवर देर श्योर मैम ओके थैंक यू The ambience of this cafe is so cozy. The paintings on the walls perfectly portray the vibrant side of Pakistan. Excuse me. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Uh so yahan menu mein uh Turkish khana kya kya hai? This is Cafe Istanbul. Oh, okay. Uh so Okay, mujhe chicken adana kebab chahiye or um Turkish cheese pide. Chicken. Okay? Thank you ma'am. Thank you for being here. Shukriya. Thank you, Thank you so you. much. यहाँ के चेफ्स को डेफिनेटली पता था कि खाना में अच्छा टेस्ट कैसा मेंटेन करना है लुक सो गुड Guys, my food is finally 
actually here I have ordered Turkish pide and Turkish Adana kebab or kanaka kushbu bohot bohot acha hai and I feel so hungry and I'm so excited to try this food so let's start So I'm going to try this first pide So good. It is really good. Mm. And I want to try kebab as well. In Turkey, we call this Adana kebab. I know in Pakistan you also have kebabs, but this is a little bit different one. Hmm. This is so delicious, really. I'm so happy to be here as well. I will visit here again to try other stuff. Thumbs up to the team of the Mall Food Court. So guys, right now Mary Saad is Istanbul Cafe owner, Mr. Abu Zarhe, and I'm going to ask him a couple of questions. Uh, thank, you, thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. We <laughs> thank are much you so much. Obliged. The food was amazing. It thank was you. so delicious. Uh, but I want to ask you something about it, actually. Yeah. Do you have a Turkish chef here or not? Actually, thank you very much. First of all, that you came and you uh, gave us this honor that we have mm -hmm. uh, hosted you. Actually, this was the idea that we wanted uh, international cuisines under one roof. Mm -hmm. So that we have tried कि हम ऐसे शेफ लेके आएं जो कि इंटरनेशनल कुजीन को एक्सपर्ट थे तो हमारे पास सीरियन शेफ हैं ही इस फ्रॉम सीरिया दैट्स ग्रेट वो सीरियन शेफ ही इस एक्सपर्ट इन टर्किश एंड लेबनीज एंड इन इन सीरियन फूड एंड अरबिक फूड एस वेल अरबिक फूड एस वेल तो so actually he's making our uh, Turkish food and um, that, that we are, we are so trying good. our best. <laughs> and I'm thankful to the people of Lahore and the tourists as well who are and they are liking it. That, that's very good. The food was really good. Thank you so much. Other than Turkish restaurants, what is here or what is here? Here actually our idea tha, that hmm. was the mall food court. Because hmm. you have seen it, you are uh, a tourist as well and you are here in Mashallah, Pakistan. Mein. So you have seen that Lahore's main mall road is a tourist attraction. And when people come here to Lahore, they go to the mall road and see tourist attractions here. For that we have the idea that all the cuisines are under one roof. And the best quality and good rates. We have done this that we have in the western burgers. Burgers. Then we have your Turkish center. We have Turkish food. Then in the middle of the middle east, we have Lebanese food and we have a mandi too. And then in the Pakistani Indian cuisines, we have Madrasi Handi and Pakistani Kadaiya Biryani, the favorite Pakistani Biryani food. And after that, we have the Chinese expert on the east side, we have the Chinese expert on the east side. So we have all the foods and it's that we are trying our best that our cuisine is like that you like the Turkish food, whatever you try, it will be good. Thank you so much. And by the way, I should tell you this. I really like the emblems that you use. Uh, did you, you design you. them by yourself? Yeah, it was my design. Yeah. Obviously, with the help of the graphics and my mm -hmm. partner. But uh, this was this was the idea that the whole world is in in, in this uh, in this uh, hall, like Cafe Istanbul That's and so China beautiful. and Pakistan and the whole world. We have we have tried the Europe. So that we can great. cover the cover the world under one roof and so people come here That's and enjoy. Great. That's a very nice idea. Shukriya, bohut bohut Aap shukriya. Bohut shukriya. Thank you so much for Thank inviting you. us, for having us You're here and for the food. You're most welcome Thank and you I so hope much. that people will come here and like it the way you liked it and I hope that you like being in Pakistan yes, as well. Yes, I, I do. I love Pakistan so much. <laughs> we also like uh, Turkey as well and, really? uh, and you have seen Thank that people so really much. like Turkey. And Turkish dramas as well. Yes. People are really good fans. Ah, Turkish dramas. Yeah, हाँ बहुत मशहूर हैं हाँ बहुत बहुत ज़्यादा लोग तो यहाँ पे नो अपने kids के नाम रखते हैं. Oh. They they name their kids after the after the big series. I didn't know that. Okay, बहुत शुक्रिया बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया. Thank you so much. Thank you. It was very good, very delicious. I enjoyed the food very much after so long. 
Thank God I tried something Turkish. And also I had a very good day. I went to the Lahore Museum for the first time in my life. It was so nice. Thanks to the museum, I got to learn so many things. Then I came here, I tried very nice food and I had such an amazing day today. So now I feel like Meredilhe Pakistani. See you next time in the next episode with a different destination. Then Allah Hafiz, güle güle.